Hey guys, it's always Hope here. Welcome back to the channel. And Apple has announced yet another beta for iOS 15. Today announcing iOS 15.5, developer beta one. Now this one was anticipated. Most of you guys already know that this one was coming, right? Apple is looking to continue to improve iOS 15 and 15.5 developer beta one is now available. Now, as per usual, Apple has also updated all their other platforms as we're used to this, right? Mac OS 12.4 beta one was released today alongside iOS 15.5 beta 1 of course iPad OS 15.5 beta 1 has been released for the iPad as well watch OS 8.6 beta 1 is available for the Apple watch and TV OS 15.5 developer beta 1 is now available as well so what's new with the latest beta of course in this video we're going to cover everything that we know so far in regards to ios 15.5 developer beta 1 now as always if you would like to stay up to date with the latest ios news and apple software updates don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode now the first thing i've noticed right after updating to ios 15.5 is a new splash screen within the news application so when i launched the news application after updating i did get this location services prompt now i haven't seen this before let me know if you've seen this on your iphone right let me know in the comments down below but it looks like apple is asking me if i still want to continue using my location for the news application to continue to deliver news that's relevant to me right to my location so of course i continue to do that in order to get some of the latest relevant news in my location here but it's a new splash screen that i noticed within the latest beta again let me know if you've seen this one before now something very interesting that apple could be working on is a new apple account card that could be linked to the wallet of your iphone in order for you to purchase movies and tv shows and maybe apple products online and things like that according to nine to five mac apple could be branding or rebranding your itunes pass as an apple account card within the wallet of your iphone so if you didn't know let's go here into the app store for example if you click on your avatar here you have have the ability to add money to your account this is your apple account and you can purchase applications purchase music movies tv shows and things like that using your balance on your apple account where it looks like apple is working internally on a new card to add to this system here where you'll be able to have a separate card just for your apple account balance so this is something that nine to five mac has mentioned and just to keep an eye on this one apple continues to roll out the driver's license feature across the united states that's something also to look forward to with 15.5 now for those of you that continue to ask will this be the last update for ios 15 and i'm thinking this is not the last update for iOS 15. If history is any indication, we still got plenty to go. Keep in mind, Apple today announced WWDC will get the first beta for iOS 16 on June 6, 2022. But keep in mind, iOS 16 won't be released until maybe late September. So there's still a lot going on with iOS 15 that Apple needs to fix and also add before some of the older devices that are staying behind, and like iPhone SE first gen and maybe iPhone 6S and iPhone 6S Plus. Those devices still depend on this software and some of the latest and final changes that could occur before iOS 16 is officially dropped. But yeah, I don't think this is going to be the last update to iOS 15, but I could be wrong. We'll have to wait and see. More information may come about in the next couple of weeks we'll find out more and there you guys have it just minor changes here with ios 15.5 for those of you that are interested here is the latest bill number for this one and there it is 15.5 it's going to be 19 f 50 Four seven e and that's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. iOS 15.5 developer beta 1 is now available, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.